Is there anything in there? Is there any money in there? Come out. Is it on? Is it on? Well, guys, you tuned into the episode. Welcome to Storage Legends. We got two totes to go through. We got a freaking ATM. You waited. Here we go. All right, guys, without further ado, let's check and see what's in here. Hopefully, we score big. Oh, it's a laptop case. Oh, my gosh, there's a laptop case. Oh, it's not in there. There's a brand new pack of Newports, but I don't smoke cigarettes. That's crazy. Oh, there's multiple. That's pretty weird. Yeah, there's multiple brand new packs of cigarettes. That's pretty much that's pretty much garbage, guys, because we can't resell tobacco. But that's pretty interesting, though. People, that's that's another first, guys. I've never really seen three new brand new packs of Newport cigarettes ever. Normally, the type of people that lose their storage units, they keep their their cigarettes on there. So okay, so check this out. Oh. Whoa. Oh, so that's pretty, that's pretty useful on the arts and crafts side. Let's see what we got here. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Hennessy XO. Oh, it's not full, but that's pretty cool though. I don't really like Hennessy, but that's, that's pretty cool. Okay, let's see what else we got. Oh, camera, camera boxes, they're not in them. Look, oh, check out what's in here. This is, this looks like tickets of some sort. They were probably doing like a raffle. They might have been raffling. They might have been raffling the ATM. Who knows? Wow, I would have got a raffle ticket for that. Um, yeah, so here's this LED light. Oh, this is an LED camera light. That's really cool, dude. LED camera light. Flame bulb, easy to install. That's pretty cool. So we got, okay, so cups, a whole more. No way, what is this? We got hey. I don't mean to we got a phone call from an ATM professional. Guys, we're already on it. I'm going to finish this tote. We got the RCA, audio RCA jacks. Oh, man. What else do we got? Oh, my gosh. There's multiple mics. One, two, and let me see here. Three mics. We got a singing machine, plastic cups. I think that's the ATM machine guy. Sheesh. Okay, hang on a second. So these bar stools are about 20 bucks, 25 bucks at least a piece. And we got at least four of them. So that's at, that's at least a hundred dollars. Um, and let's check this out. Oh, yeah, that is a food time. Wow. Alright, here, yeah, let's bring, let's bring all this out here. Yo, yo, guys, check this out. I just, I, I looked at it and pulled it away. So not only do we got a brand new speaker right here, check it out in here, come in here. This is why we buy storage units. These are all cool. Everything in here is brand new. And right here, the legs are in there. So that's super awesome. It's, there's a little like zipper for the legs, but check this out. I'm gonna move out the way. You get, you guys get in there. Get in there. I'm gonna move this out the way. Oh, look at that! Oh my goodness! Oh, get a full. Of a hole. Look at how big it is, bro. That thing is like freaking ten feet. No, it's probably like a, a good five and a half feet. No, that's probably like. Dude, look at me. I look at my look at me and look at how tall it is to me. I'm 5'10. This has to be every bit of like of like 4'10, 4'11. That's nuts. 
So, okay, so this is a Top Tech Audio. Look, it's, it's got rollers. Oh, this is tight right here. This made the purchase so worth it, dude. Holy crap, look at that. Whoa. Guys, comment below right now, what, what is this worth? It's um, it's an angle three one two. Look at look, it even has a it even has it even has a way to spin. It's it got turntables on it, and then on the top it has like a like a DJ like disco kind of thing. Man, this thing is nuts. This thing is crazy. Holy crap! This is a cool find, man. No, go ahead. Go ahead, fam. You got it. No, you're good. You're good. You're good. <laughs> it's, it's funny, guys, because I'm on my way home, and people see this ATM in my backseat, and they're freaking out, and it's so funny. All right, I finally made it home. Ladies and gentlemen, let me just formally point out that I never thought I would ever have an ATM in the back of my truck, ever. We're going to have to... Oh, we're gonna have to get this thing open, man. I wonder what's in it. It says MetaBank may charge a fee to card holders for each cash withdrawal. This fee is added to the amount of your withdrawal and is in addition to fees that may be charged. Definitely an old one. This thing is completely cracked. Yep, there's Pineapple Express behind me. She's been just hanging out. We haven't used it for a while. It's so old, man. General Financial Services. Let me see. Wait a minute, maybe, maybe I should call that number and say, hey, I got an ATM. Yeah, let's call that number. We're gonna call this number really quick. Ugh. All right, guys, we're gonna call this number right now. Nine, two, nine, four, six, two, six, seven, nine. Okay, here. So it's a WRG brand. I just wonder, I wonder what year it is. We're just literally we're just sitting on an ATM in the back of my truck. I never thought I would be doing this right now. This is a crazy ATM machine. I really wonder if it has. Man. Mm. Mm. Okay. Hopefully something, huh? Something, guys. People were looking at me crazy. I was I was driving on the street and people were just looking at me like, what in the world is this guy doing with an ATM machine? Okay, here. Hang on, let's see if this works. Let's see if this works. My grandpa always did this. To the TV. Okay, here, um, let's see if this works, huh? Let's see, hang on. My grandma always did that. That usually works for me. I usually settle down. Let's see if that works, hang on. Ugh, nothing. Okay, I need to find a TV remote to, to do what my mom used to do. All right, guys, we're gonna try to see if we can find a TV remote in my garage. Oh man, here goes all the cool stuff that we've seen from all the units, guys. <laughs> okay, hang on. We gotta find, I'm gonna find a TV remote and try my mom's method. Oh, look at all these wallets. There's so much stuff to sell. Look at that. There's so much stuff to still sell. I told you guys. Okay, we're gonna look for this TV remote. Okay, what are these? 
Who wallet. Okay, hang on. The Led Zeppelin wallet. No, that's not a TV remote. Okay, we gotta find a TV remote. Okay, hang on a second. Okay, oh, we might find one in here. Hang on. We got a Blu-ray player. We might find a TV remote in here. Let's see. This is just a total of just random stuff. Look, this is really nice. You guys would probably want one of these. Nautical. My uncle collects nautical stuff. Let's see here. Okay. What do we got? Yeah, look at that. The dream catcher. That's pretty cool. Okay, hang on a second. Oh, this is another dream catcher. Okay, don't catch my dreams. I like to dream. Oh, what are these? Oh, I got the black diamonds, guys. I got the black diamond classic Beauty and the Beast. There it is in good condition. Another black diamond. The black diamond right there is the Disney um, VHSs that are just... Legend has it, they sell for a lot of money on eBay. <laughs> I've never seen anybody sell them, guys, but they sell for a lot of money, guys. Go ahead and do your search right now. Do, do a quick Google search on how much they sell for. Okay. okay, we're coming up short on a TV remote. Um, let me see, I might have to look inside. Oh, I found another mouse. Oh, this is probably the last mouse ever. Dude, this is probably the last mouse known to existence. Holy crap. We're going to have to sell them. We're going to have to sell them next week. You guys know all about the legendary mouses. And they're gone. Dave got a lot of them. But they are gone. Okay. We got a door. That's, yeah, that's definitely not a, that's definitely not a remote. Okay. Okay, we gotta kind of find. Okay, we're gonna have to look inside. Okay. All right, we're in the basement. Got a couple Storage Legends t shirts here. Um, let's see what else we got. Looks like cards. Oh, guys, I wanna show you what my mom would do. Hang on. We're pretty much, we're back in the garage. We pretty much, we checked everywhere. I don't know if I'll ever be able to exemplify this to you guys. What the heck is that? A life jacket? Let's see here. Okay, that's a broken toe. What the heck is this even? What What is this? There's a TV, so there might be a remote. We're looking for a remote. Remember that, guys. Oh, for walleye. Okay, guys, that's a fish lot. That's a fish lot. Right, just put that over. Put that over there. Okay, hang on. Okay. What do we got? Indians tickets. Looks like something something in the wilderness. I don't know what that is. Something. That's something else too. Alright, we're just gonna have to take this whole toad out because what is what is this stuff? honestly just getting distracted here just digging i found a whole freaking magic pack box deck guys incredible look at this i don't know if you guys remember me finding this but i forgot i found this to be honest let's see here oh, okay yeah look at all this guys holy crap it's all magic cards All magic cards, guys. It looks like a deck. And then at the bottom here, there's a little flap for your dice. That's really cool. It's like a deck box or something. 
so while looking for a remote guys i got caught up in all this cool stuff in the garage so i i did just find um oh it looks like it fell somewhere where'd it go oh right here um the sorcerer sorcerer set and then look check this out this is all camaro hot wheels we got star wars toys we got more hot wheels I don't know if you guys remember these, but these are kind of cool. Look, glass marbles. No way. In the pack still from the 80s. Sheesh. So, yeah, this is a little box I dug into. I'm going to kind of take all the toys. Let's see what else we got. Oh, another one. Yes. Another one. Okay, we'll put that over there. Okay. Let's see what else is in here. Look, there's more signs. You guys love the signs. The signs are cool. Look at that. That's a cool one. I don't think I've ever sold that one. So let's see. Okay, Blue Streak Series. Guys, comment below. Is this a good one? Blue Streak Series. Um, it's got 1996. Okay, look at that. That's cool. It's broken, but that's kind of cool. The Ohio State pins. Nice. Goldberg. That's cool. Oh! Tons of knives. What? Let's see what's under here. Come on, come on. Oh, I don't know what that is. Leather, what, wallets? No, that's got to be for, like, your keys or something. And a slinky. So what else is in here? More leather bands. And then these are really cool, too. These are Ohio, the Buckeye State. Look at these, though. Holy crap. Look at all these knives. Oh, my goodness. They're all Barlow's. Parlo. Parlo. Wow. That's cool. This one says Barlow. And then Parlo. That's pretty crazy. That is pretty crazy. Oh. What does this say? Oh, it's a hummingbird. All right, guys. Well, I got caught up in a box. Let's get back to finding this remote. All right, guys, can't even lie. I got super distracted. I'm going through all kind of stuff in here. Okay, we're just going to pretend this weight. Pretend that this weight, this three-pound weight right here, would be a Time Warner cable remote, okay? Let's just pretend that that's, that that's the case. All right, if it was my mom, she would probably give about... So you probably give about two warnings and then this would be the remote, okay? So let's try to use my mom's tactic. We use my grandpa's tactic and my grandma's tactic. This is my mom's tactic, okay? All right, ATM, open up here. All right, all right, she would always say, um, let me see here, she would always go. Um, okay, uh, darn it, Andrew! Okay, let's see if that works, guys. Let's see if that works. Okay, remember guys, this is mom's tactic. Ah, this didn't work. Didn't work. Man, I was really hoping mom's tactic would have worked. Ah, we'll give it here. Let's let's do another statement. Okay, hang on. Hang on. Go to your room! Oh, I almost, I almost busted my window. Okay, hang on. Hang on. Ah, nothing on that either. No way. Uh, let me see. You know what? We're just going to have to call the gang. We're going to have to figure this out. I wonder if there's blue dye in there. Let's see. Is there anything? Let me see. Okay. Nothing in there. I see a hole at the bottom. Is there anything in there? Is there any money in there? Come out. All right. All right, well, guys, I, I need some more help. 
I gotta, I gotta get somebody else's opinion so on. We need this. some more advice, and we have to figure out oh, that's a car crash. Almost happened. <laughs> you already do that. No, 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 run it, run it, run it. We need some more advice, and we need some, we need another opinion on this ATM. Obviously, it's nothing that we ever dealt with. So I got my friend. This is you, Rob. This is you. What? <laughs> I got my. <laughs> I thought you were gonna do something. Take two. Ready? Not Greg. All right, guys. I went and bought my, brought my friend Bruce. Wait, no, cut it again. I'm sorry. <laughs> went and recruited my friend Bruce Wayne. What? Quit. What? For what purpose? So, come on in, guys. Come on in. So you guys know I got the ATM. Now I got the auctioneer extraordinaire Robert Zabos here. Look at that. Yeah, yeah. I tried everything I got. One, in all your years of doing this, have you ever acquired an ATM? I'm not gonna talk about that on camera. <laughs> Number two, what is your suggestion, man? What what is your suggestion? I have an ATM. We're gonna have to crack it open, maybe, or should we sell it as this? You want to auction it off? We got to open it. What do you it. think? Okay. See, Andrew, you're from a different generation. Guapa. Nah. All right, Guapa. You see, you're from a different generation. My generation, we knew there's one way to open or get anything working. You know what way that was? It's called the Fonzie Touch. So, guys, I have to ask you what. <laughs> So you do recommend breaking it open? I would say you have to break open the safe. And how do you recommend breaking it open? Well, Andrew, you're from a different generation than me. Bro's <laughs> 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 guapo, bro. I'm sorry. Guapo. I don't know what. Andrew, guapo, whatever. Go, go. Just don't, don't cut no. it. Don't cut it. Don't, don't, don't cut it. Go ahead. This could be it. All right. All right. It's going to be good. Let's take it. Greg. All right. Why is it? Alright. Guys. Okay, how do you suggest to break it open? Guapo. First of all, if you're gonna break it open, there's only one way to do it. Different generation than you. Your generation, you probably try to kick it. Maybe tween at it. My generation, Fonzie Touch. All right, looks it like we're, probably, work. we're probably gonna have to take a sledgehammer to it. Now, two things that we figured out. Let's try it. Hold on, hold on, hold on. There's another thing for my generation that used to work all the time. Hulk Hogan move, atomic leg drop. Do it. Sledgehammer. Man, okay, we're gonna have to do the sledgehammer. We officially found out we're gonna break this open. That's, I guess that's that's the auctioneer extraordinaire opinion of the situation. We're all gonna get together and we're gonna break this bad boy open. We can drop it off the top of the building. To be continued. At this point, guys, this has been the episode. Tune in tomorrow because I'm gonna definitely have like a sledgehammer, and um, with or without anyone this ATM will be opened tomorrow.